And this time we are watching for that potential track to be close to East Texas and wrap some of the rain into North Texas. So that would be uh, certainly giving us some rain by at least early next week. Let's take a look at that. Cristobal is uh, still circulating there around southern Mexico. It's going to slowly be drifting in the next 48 hours back over uh, open water and back into the Gulf where it can gain steam. It can gain some momentum as it gets over those warm waters. And you can see that track as we put it into overnight Friday. It's really starting to lift further to the north through the Gulf and it will continue on what looks to be a north northwest track. So what does that mean? It means still kind of eyeing the same areas, uh, East Texas, Louisiana, and then over into the Mississippi coast for the potential impact initially. And then we'll continue to monitor it uh, overnight Sunday into Monday. That is where we could pick up some rain here in North Texas. So uh, for us, it's going to be some scattered rain, it looks like. I'm not concerned with flooding so much, but at least a wet forecast and a slightly cooler forecast, which by that point, I think we all will be happy to uh, receive. Right now, we have got a warm, muggy start again, 75 degrees, dew point of 72, extremely humid air already early on this Thursday morning. South-southwest winds today, that'll be helping us to warm up even more so, up to about 15 miles per hour at times. And then as you can see, these numbers staying in the mid to upper 70s across the board, Keller 77, Bridgeport at 75, Mesquite, you're waking up to 73. The rest of the day today, lots of sunshine to enjoy. Uh, if you can get out early, it'll be nice out there, but then it turns really hot later this afternoon. We'll be talking about mid-90s with that feels-like temperature pushing the century mark by mid to late afternoon. So again, I want to talk about what happens as we push on into the weekend. We are expecting most of the weekend to be dry. Uh, taking it into Friday, Saturday, we're seeing occasional clouds roll in. Hot temperatures will be around as well. And then those clouds start to build in, especially by Sunday. But our rain impact from Cristobal would be on Monday. So we'll continue to focus on that day in particular. Locations east of I-35 will be under the gun for some potential rain. And then we'll all get a slight cool down as we go on into Monday before seeing a fast warm up next week where highs get into the upper 90s.